This coming weekend, we're expecting to see levels we haven't seen since before the pandemic. That's the warning from the Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg as we head into Memorial Day weekend. Charlotte Douglas is expecting more than 140,000 additional passengers. In fact, we've learned they're bringing in extra staff to ensure you get to your destination with as few problems as possible. WBTV's Faith Alford live for us at Charlotte Douglas. Faith, we know it's busy, but you have some really good ways to help make the trip a little <laughs> smoother. Yeah, good morning to you, Mary. The best advice I can give to travelers is to get here early. The lines are going to be long, and it's the official kickoff of the summer travel season. Now, we're here close to Terminal C. I'm going to show you guys what I'm seeing here. You see people are already checking in those bags. They're getting to the airport, getting on those early morning flights. So it may be 5 a.m., but I have some people here who are up here early with us this morning. Now, wait times could reach up to 45 minutes this holiday weekend. Charlotte Douglas says they're expecting close to 4 450,000 travelers over the next few days. That's about 40,000 more than last Memorial Day weekend. Now, here are some ways to make things easier for you. One, you want to plan ahead. You want to do things like book your parking spot before you get here. Download the Charlotte Douglas app. It gives you real-time wait times for these TSA lines and updates on that parking map. And you want to be patient. Charlotte Doug Douglas is bringing in extra staff, and the large crowds will cause longer wait times. The airport also wants to remind Mind travelers, there are consequences for bad behavior in bad behavior in those lines. There is a civil penalty that you can get from TSA, uh, can go upwards of fifteen thousand uh, dollars, in addition to whatever uh, local law enforcement decides to, to do as well. So, uh, please think about that, uh, and, and please respect the folks that are working uh, extra hard to make sure you can get to where you're going on vacation. All the extra travelers is one thing, but also our meteorologist, Al Coughlin, has told you that we're going to have some weather issues as well this morning, so this weekend, excuse me. So you're going to want to note those things. So coming up in the next 30 minutes, I'll tell you how Charlotte Douglas is planning to handle potential delays. Live in Charlotte, Faith Alford, WBTV, on your side.